Number 1 Piazza Maggiore and Piazza del Nettuno. It may seem as though everyone in Bologna were meeting friends at the same time in these two adjoining squares in the heart of the city. Conversation and laughter blend with the sound of water splashing in the magnificent Neptune fountain, which gives Piazza del Nettuno its name. Number 2 Basilica of Ste. Petronius. When construction of the massive church that dominates one side of Piazza Maggiore began in 1390, it was designed to be even bigger than Ste. Peter's in Rome, but never quite made it. In fact, it was never finished, and the facade remains incomplete. In the tiny museum at the back of the church, you can see the designs that were submitted for the facade, including those by the great architect Andrea Palladio. Number 3 Stay Stephen Basilica While Bologna has no shortage of interesting and art-filled churches, Santo Stefano is the oldest and the most atmospheric. The complex of eight buildings could be called the Cradle of Faith in Bologna, built by the Benedictines between the 10th and 13th centuries to house the remains of Bologna's early martyrs, Saints Vitali and Agricola. Number 4 Leaning Towers Pieces may be more famous, but Bologna has a pair of towers that appear to tilt even more alarmingly because of their narrow shape. They are the best known of the 20 towers that remain of the more than 100 that formed Bologna's 12th century skyline. Number 5 Sanctuary and Portico of the Madonna di San Luca The basilica stands atop a hill that commands views across the city and the Pavali landscape, its classical interior highlighted by the striking floor of inlaid black, white, and red marble floor. The chancel is lined in equally striking variegated black and white marble. Number 6 Bolognese Food Perhaps Bologna's greatest appeal to tourists, and the source of its fame throughout Italy, is its reputation as a culinary center. It's known for tortellini, tagliatelle, and other pastas, and its classic dish, tagliatelle al ragu, is known elsewhere simply as tagliatelle bolognese. Cured meats are a local specialty, and this region is the home of the incomparable Parmigiano-Reggiano cheese. Number 7 Archigenasio Anatomical Theatre Once the main building of the University of Bologna, the Archigenasio is now home to one of the most unusual places in Bologna, the classroom where medical students learned anatomy by watching as corpses were dissected. It's not this bizarre aspect that fascinates today so much as the exceptional interior and its unusual wood carving. Number 8 Bologna's Portici Visitors to Bologna can't help strolling under the portici, the arcades that line so many of its streets. They are a welcome relief from the summer sun and shelter from the rain, as well as providing extra space to shops, which often display goods under them. Number 9 Stay Dominic Church At the death in 1221 of St. Dominic, Indiana this convent of the order he founded, work began on the church that took several centuries to complete. The marble tomb that enshrines his remains is reason enough to visit, carved in minute details by the greatest artists of the day, including Michelangelo and Nicola Pisano. Number 10 Archaeological Museum Even those who normally tune out at museums of antiquities will enjoy this remarkably up-to-date display of prehistoric and Etruscan finds from the surrounding area, as well as outstanding treasures from the Celtic, Greek, Egyptian, and Roman civilizations. There are only two other museums in Italy that can match its Egyptian collection. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.